What's going on guys, I'm Bill and welcome to Bill's How To. Today we're going to be looking at how to remove mold and in my opinion, how to kill it. Let's get straight into it guys, let's do this. And after a few minutes, the ceiling's looking like brand new again. All right guys, so today I'm going to show you guys how I remove mold and in my opinion, kill it off. And the reason why I say, in my opinion, kill it off is because there's so much conflicting information out there. It's a very controversial topic. I'm sure if you Google or if you do any research, does bleach kill mold? Because that's in fact what I use. Um, you'll find a whole range of different things um, from yes to no to it actually feeds the mold. Um, so today I'm gonna show you guys how it is that I clean it off using bleach. And to be honest, I haven't had any issues. Now I've been doing this for over 10 years and every single time I clean it off with bleach, come back over years and years and years, and I've never ever come back across the mold reappearing. Now, there's only been one situation where it's actually come back, and the reason for that is because the cause wasn't addressed. So, most common cause for mold growing in your house is poor ventilation, condensation, moisture. So, in this case here, we're downstairs in the laundry, and we've got an upstairs bathroom right above this uh, section here, and the waterproofing has failed. So, water seeped through, caused all of this damage, and this has been resolved upstairs now. So, I'm gonna show you guys how to clean it off, and I'll show you upstairs as well, another little demonstration of how effective it is. All right, so what I use is just a little mop with a swivel head, makes it a bit easier to get up on the roof. If you want, wear a mask, and I do recommend wearing a mask, um, but I'm not gonna be wearing one in this case. I'm gonna be in and out of here in hopefully a minute or two. Close off this door and I'll be working in, in the other side of the house. So, spray bottle full of bleach, whether you put half strength, full strength, it's honestly up to you. I'm gonna spray some on the head of this mop here, and then we're just gonna quickly wipe it off, and I'll leave the camera in here so that you guys can watch it get to work. It shouldn't take too long. All right, so we've got the mop ready to go. Wipe it all over, over the whole place. That bleach is gonna do its job, and we'll try and scrub it. We might have to apply it twice. Alright, we'll let this one here sit for a bit, I'm going to head out for a couple minutes, come back and we'll repeat the process. Alright, so it's been about five minutes, it's looking pretty good so far, we're going to give it a second coat. You can use the edge of the mop to get in all those little grooves. So once again, just leave it on there for a few minutes. And after a few minutes, the ceiling's looking like brand new again. The mold is completely gone. In my experience, it's completely been killed off as well because I've never had it return unless the underlying issue is still there. So if you've got bad ventilation, you've got bad exhaust fan in the bathroom, condensation building up, you're gonna have a repeat of the same issue. So I'll quickly show you guys upstairs another example. We're upstairs in the main bathroom, and as you can tell, that exhaust fan there doesn't really work very well. That's all the mold, and if they don't replace this exhaust fan right here, it's just basically gonna return. So, I'll show you guys this one here being cleaned, and I'll show you the finished result as well. Once again, just let it sit there for a bit. And once this one here's done, this is what it ends up looking like, almost looks like it's just been freshly painted. So there you have it guys, that's how I get rid of mold and in my experience I'm also killing it off. I know there's a lot of conflicting information out there. I could be wrong, I could be right, but in my experience it's been working. I also use cleaning vinegar or some people use white vinegar. Um, that seems to work sometimes, but sometimes it doesn't once again, so I don't really use vinegar that often. Um, if you've got another solution, let me know in the comment section below guys. We're all here to learn, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video, you've learned something new, and if you want to try it try it if you don't want to try it well you can cut the ceiling out you can try and stain block it or seal it all off um, you can do whatever it is that you like but I'm trying to help you guys out this is what I have found works for me in the past hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video as always like comment and subscribe until next time I'm Bill thanks for watching Bill's out too